hey guys hello everyone and welcome to the channel so if you are someone who is looking for some summer training program or want to join as a trainee uh, for uh, for the uh, internship purpose in that case indra gandhi center for atomic research has announced a very good opportunity to join as a summer training program in physics and chemistry so it is in short called as stipac now this is one of the very famous and very well known program which indira gandhi center for atomic research basically announces every year and this is under department of atomic energy by government of india this is the official website of it all you have to do for the uh, notification you have to come down to the announcement section and here you can see here it says announcement for stipac or stipac whatever you call it for 2023 so once you click on this you will be uh, able to download a pdf file on this pdf all the details are there okay so let me tell you the important things about it so first of all it's a organized by indira gandhi center for atomic research department of atomic energy kalpakkam that is in tamil nadu now this is a summer training in physics and chemistry known as stipac 2023 which will be held from may 29th to july 7th 2023 now indira gandhi center for atomic research is conducting a six week summer training program in physics that is stip and in chemistry that is called as stic for students who are entering in their final year or regular or integrated msc so this program is for those students who are entering that means who have qualified first year of their msc and who are going in the second year of msc okay now students completing msc in 2023 should not apply so this is not for those who are in the final year it is strictly for those who are going to finish their phd uh, sorry their msc in 2024 now this is a six week long program and it will comprise both theoretical lecture courses and hands on laboratory experience through projects now this program is aimed to motivating a student to pursue career in the research the theme of this year course is role of defects in materials so this is the theme of this year's work that means this year this whole project will be oriented towards material sciences a little bit okay now what are the benefits of it let's look upon this okay so 25 students will be selected in each discipline that means 25 students will be selected in physics and 25 students will be selected in chemistry the selected students will be provided with a stipend of 11000 rupees okay um, and that will be given for the complete duration of the course all right now subsidized accommodation on the payment basis will also be given and travel expenses by the sleeper class train or bus which is non ac that will be provided to you so your travel allowance and you are also going to get a subsidized accommodation and along with that you are going to get 11000 as a stipend for doing this particular project now, what is the eligibility so a consistently good academic track record with first class in bsc and first semester of the msc and with a strong desire to take up a research career so if you have all these things you can apply for this okay as i said it is very important to uh, like have a good academic record that means in your bsc you should be having good marks in your msc also you should be having in the first semester or in the first year of msc you should be having good marks and uh, if you have a strong desire to do research that's this is the best thing which you can do now how you can apply you can fill the form by clicking on this link i will give you the link in the description of this video you can directly click on that link to fill the form let us talk about few more things what you have to do in the form basically in the form you will be asked to provide a write up okay which is not exceeding 1000 words means you have to write a write up in around 1000 words and the topic is role of defects in material and it's my perspective it means what's your perspective uh, that how the role of defects means the defects which are caused in the materials defects you must have studied in solid state chemistry right like uh, Frankel defect Schottky defect so what is the role of those defects uh, and what is your perspective about it you have to write that write up you have to write that write up in your own words and should not be copy pasted from any online material they have mentioned it very clearly now for any further clarification if, if you are want to do clarification for physics you can uh, contact here for chemistry you can contact here now it says that please bring the notice to the attention to all the colleges having msc program in physics and chemistry affiliated to the university so this is the website they have just said it 
so deadline for the submission is uh, of the application form along with the write up is 15th of april 2023 so in case if you are interested and you fulfill and you fulfill all the uh, eligibility criteria in that case please apply for it okay i will tell you how to apply so once you click on this link the link is there in the description you directly have to click on that link and you will be able to come up to this particular page okay so this is a google form kind of thing now here it says that it's stipac 2023 application form igcr alpakkam and all the details are here and it will uh, ask you that what are the things which you have to take care of so it says for the first point that the form once submitted cannot be admitted uh, cannot be edited or resubmitted last date of submission is 15th of april as i mentioned already the applicant will get the acknowledge acknowledgement of the successful submission of the email address so once you fulfill uh, once you fill the form and once the form is sent they will send you a acknowledgement mail so in the question where your bsc msc first semester marks is asked you have to write the percentage marks that means in case you got the marks in percentile you have to convert that into percentage and then you have to fill there now in case of msc first semester or first year results are awaited please write result awaited in the corresponding column before filling the form as they have mentioned you need to write a write up that you have to write in in ms word and from there you can copy here okay so you have to write in your own words in the ms word or in wordpad and from there you can copy and paste in the space which is provided here the instruction for preparing the write up is as follows is it is mentioned that it should not be copy pasted it should be in your own word make sure that it is not exceeding 1000 words and figures and equations are not required okay uh, all you have to do is you have to look upon the email address here you have to fill the email address and you have to select that which subject you want to apply for your name your gender your date of birth your home address your mobile number alternate phone number parents or guardians mobile number university name college department college department address then state or your in territory in which you belong to bsc marks percentage msc first semester marks percentage and just click over here and next and then you have to basically write the uh, write up and that's how the three steps will be done for this form okay so this was about stipac it is one of the places or one of the opportunity where uh, you can explore the things and uh, you can get into it which is going to help you if you want to pursue research in future these things are going to help you in future during your interviews and all the other right so that's it for this video i just thought of making this video so that i can inform you about it thank you so much for watching and if you have any other queries you can ask in the comment section below thank you so much for watching see you in the next one till then have a great day bye bye take care